Hello everybody and welcome to the third and final installment of I Gotta Be Honest With You Bro. It is Friday, November 13th, 7.55 a.m. I'm Crocodame. Now, you may or may not have noticed, I shut down my Facebook for a while, maybe a month, maybe two months, popping in seldomly here and there when I felt like I might have something to say. Now, what I enjoyed about not being here <clears throat> was I wasn't sitting there aimlessly and mindlessly checking and scrolling like some type of zombie with drool coming out of my mouth. Nah. Not constantly wondering and checking to see, did somebody like my video? Did somebody comment on my status? Did they see my picture and think that I was beautiful? The problem with Facebook people is it makes you care too much what others think. Maybe you should take some time in your life to think about what you think of yourself. Because as much as your reputation may be important to a certain extent, it's also very important of how you feel about yourself. It was nice to not be a zombie. And what I notice when I look on here is a lot of people love and like to talk about the walking dead. Well, let me tell you something, bro. You are the walking dead. If Jimmy, Johnny, Joey, and Jackie go to Acapulco's restaurant in Beverly, Mass., I guarantee you all four of them are sitting there staring at their cell phones saying, I'm at Acapulco's with Jimmy, Johnny, Joey, and Jackie. You don't need to do that, bro. You're out there in the real world. When you're in the real world, you don't need to be on the book. You don't need to say, look what I saw on the book. Because that's the only interaction you're going to have is putting your phone in front of somebody's face to show them something you saw on the book. Ugh. Now, Facebook makes it very clear. They don't want you here to meet new people. They don't want you requesting people you don't know. So here's the question. Why do I need to keep some relationship alive with some jackass I knew in high school? Why do I need to keep some relationship alive with some jackass I knew in middle school? And why on God's green earth would I ever need to keep alive some relationship with somebody I knew in elementary school? So this is how it's going to go. And this is how it goes in the real world, bro. Maybe one day we'll see each other in Walgreens Pharmacy. And we're going to do one of two things. We're either going to look at the ground straight ahead and ignore each other. Or we're going to look each other in the eye and say, hey, bro, it's been a long time, bro. How's the wife and kids? And if it seems necessary, maybe we'll go have a sip together. <sighs> because if I ain't seen you. In two years, we're through. So here's what's going on. I'm shutting my Facebook down again. I am turning it off. And I am gone. I am ghost. I am history channel. Maybe I'll pop in from time to time if I feel like I have something of importance to tell you. But otherwise, I'm going to live my life the way life was meant to be lived. I hope you all have a good weekend. I'm Crocodile. Peace.